Here's meteorologist Keith Bradberg, sponsored by Jim Bass Cars and Trucks. And welcome back, everybody. Looking at our six-hour time lapse here, we had a little bit of that sunshine coming out for a bit, and then more clouds coming in. We're going to continue to have that cloudy cover as we go through majority of our afternoon. Right now, we have. 66 degrees in San Angelo, winds coming from the northeast at 14 miles an hour. And kind of looking at how much rain we've got, the two biggest things to take a note on for the total, we've gotten just over an inch and a half, and we are actually sitting a little over a quarter of an inch above average for this time of year. And that's good because right now we definitely need to clear out this drought condition that we have at this time around most of the region. Temperatures are currently sitting in the 60s across the Concho Valley with the exception Eden is actually a little bit cooler, 58 degrees right now. Temperatures across the state here, 60s and 70s, so starting to warm up slightly with this cold front making its way out of the area. And we still have scattered showers and storms to the east and the southern parts. We actually have a few more showers making their way into our area. So we have mostly in the eastern edge of the Contro Valley and then just barely scraping past the border of Crockett County at this time. Breaking down our day planner, we are going to have cloudy conditions through most of the afternoon. And then we are going to start to see some scattered showers and thunderstorms late afternoon to the evening. Winds coming from the northeast, 10 to 15 miles an hour. Highs are expected to be in the 60s as we go through our day. And the reason we're having this funky weather is because even though we have this ridge that's sitting over us having all of this warmer air coming up, we have this low pressure system that's keeping that from getting to our area. And then you'll notice as we get into Sunday at noon, that low pressure will push over our region. We actually can see that in our future cast here. Like I said, scattered showers tonight, overnight into tomorrow morning, and then that'll kind of push off. But this rotation here, that's the low pressure system moving off to the east of our area as we get into this weekend. Now, if you do have any travel plans, just take an idea of gas prices, averages for Texas is the second lowest state in the U.S., 257 on average per gallon. San Angelo averages 268, two cents cheaper than what we had this time last year. Looking at the rest of our seven-day forecast here, we will have more sunshine starting Sunday afternoon, highs in the 90s, and then we're looking at more sunny skies as we get into this upcoming Wednesday. And then we will have another cold front make its way through on Thursday and a slight chance of spotty showers with highs in the 60s. You're watching KLST News at noon. We'll be right back after.